In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get this free pink diamond Embiid moments card in NBA 2K23. My team, I still can't believe that 2K is giving us a free pink diamond Joel Embiid. And all you guys have to do is come over to your season agendas, scroll all the way, uh, I'll scroll all the way down to the bottom to the moments section, click on the moments Embiid, and then you guys can see this is going to be the stat line you have to put up. Score 59 points with any Joel Embiid in a game. Going to be very, very easy to do with this Amethyst card. Get 8 assists with uh, Joel Embiid in any game. Going to be very easy to do as well. Get 11 rebounds with Embiid in, game, in a game is going to be super easy. This one will probably be the only difficult one. Get seven blocks with any Joel Embiid in a game. That one might be a little bit difficult. Make one three-pointer with any Joel Embiid in a game. Shouldn't really be that difficult as well. And then get one steal with any Joel Embiid in a game. Once again, guys, for a pink diamond Embiid, that is going to be an amazing free center. I feel like those challenges are really not that bad at all. And you guys should be definitely grinding for it. If you guys want to know what's the best game mode to play, what you guys want to do is obviously put Embiid in your lineup, right? So make a, make a new lineup do whatever you guys want right put and beat in your lineup whether you want to use his pink diamond if you have him or if you want to use his amethyst which i bet you a lot of people would so what you guys want to do is go over to the challenge screen go to the basketball fundamentals and you guys want to play the inside scoring one the reason why it's super super nice is because it's on semi-pro difficulty and it's going to be 12 minute quarters so you can play this challenge right get your 59 points your 11 rebounds your eight assists your your seven blocks your one steal your one three you can do it all in this game super easy because it's on semi-pro and then you can all you have to do to end the game and the game all you have to do to end the challenge and end the game is score five Five baskets off post moves of the player right do that with Embiid while you're trying to do his points and the game will end as soon as you make five post fadeaways which is really really nice because then all you have to do is do your challenges and then the game will end pretty much right away once you do the po of the five post moves whether it's post fadeaways drop steps post hooks whatever you guys want to do it's definitely the best challenge to do so make sure to be doing the inside scoring looking at Embiid here though on 2kdb just quickly want to check with the card look at his stats i mean he's going to be a free pink diamond so he's definitely worth going for especially with how easy it is to do but just talking about you know what he looks like in game or at least stats wise so he's a center seven foot with a seven foot five wingspan looking at his stats i mean he's not going to be insanely good of a center but he's still going to be really really good like 77 three balls decent 71 speeds a little bit low but i do like his defense he's a really good interior defender 95 interior with a 97 block is going to be really nice he's also got hall of fame anchor and post lockdown which is really really good so you guys can see the stats on the screen he's going to be a good finisher on the rim he's going to be a solid defender as well and we all know mb does have a pretty decent jump shot so for a free center guys i think he's going to be absolutely amazing let me know in the comment section down below what do you guys think about the pink diamond Embiid and let me know if you guys are going to be grinding for him and just let me know what you guys think about them adding pink diamond moments cards in my team. So hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure you drop a sub and like down below and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.